Everybody in this community has a gun, how Oakland lost its grip on gun violence, the red-tipped bullet pierces skin and melts into it, Javier Velasquez Lopez explains. The green-tipped bullet penetrates armored vests. And the hollow-tipped bullet expands as it tears through bodies. At 19, Velasquez Lopez knows a lot about ammunition because many of his friends own guns, he said. They carry to defend themselves in East Oakland, where metal bars protect shop windows and churches stand behind tall, chain-link fences, some people even hide AR-15 style assault weapons down their pants legs, he said, it doesn't feel safe. Wherever you're at, you're always anxious, said Velasquez Lopez. Who dreams of leaving the city where he was born? You're always wondering what's going to happen. Last year, two gunmen in ski masks stormed his high school, killing a school district carpenter and injuring five other adults, including two students. Oakland won acclaim just a few years ago as a national model for gun violence prevention, in part by bringing police and community groups together to target the small number of people suspected of driving the gun violence. Then, in 2020, the COVID-19 pandemic shut down schools, businesses, and critical social services nationwide, leaving many low-income people